Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be taking a look at a new Sailor Moon Gap Chapon set. Uh, this is the Milky Pop Acrylic Charm set. As you can see, it's a set of six charms. They come with a bracelet for you to attach them to. These are quite large. Um, as you can see, they advertise it as being big, um, which they definitely, definitely are. Um, so the first charm we have here is the Moonstick, followed by the Cosmic Heart Compact, the Pink Moonstick, the Prism Heart Compact, the Crystal Carillion, and the Crystal Star Compact. And the charms themselves are quite shiny and quite large. As you can see, they're about an inch and a half. And they each come with a little clip. that can be used to attach it to the chain, which comes with the Crystal Star Compact only, it seems. Um, so if you were to get these out of the capsule machine, you wouldn't be able to attach it to a bracelet unless you did get that one. Now these cost about 300 yen each. Uh, and they were released in October of 2016. Uh, it's about the price equivalence of $3 US. Although the exchange rates have changed since October, um, so that may vary. They're very smooth. You can feel the detail here. And each piece comes with a rhinestone. So right here we have a clear rhinestone The Cosmic Heart has the rhinestone in the middle. The other ones are just painted on. They're very light too. There's not a whole lot of weight to them. Here's the pink moon stick. The detail is very good. The paint job is very good. little nick on this one right here. Um, you know, given that these are capsule machine toys, the quality is very good. Um, but obviously they will have defects from time to time. This one's very pretty. I like the Carillion. Now these are quite large. Um, not sure why they made them so big. Um, normally you would want something smaller to wear on your wrist, but I'll go ahead and I'll attach them all to the bracelet and we'll see how it looks on. Okay, so I've gone ahead and attached them all to the bracelet. I tried to space them out pretty evenly and I decided to put the two wands on either side of the main pendant. Um, which, as you can see, is completely attached to the bracelet. So, if you wanted to wear the bracelet with just one of them, this would be your only option. Otherwise, you would have to get a different chain to attach one of these two to wear. Um, not quite sure why they did that. It kind of limits your options with the set. Um, and you would have to purchase another chain of some sort or use something that you already have in order to achieve the effect of maybe just one of these others. Otherwise, you'd have to do a combination. Um, on the sheet here, they show you attaching three, not all five. Um, perhaps that was their intent that you always have this one in the middle and then put two more with it. Um, but, you know, I mean, fashion is whatever you want it to be. So if you wanted to do just one, say just this one or this one, you would need another chain. Um, but I'll go ahead and I'll put it on. We'll see how it looks on a wrist. Alrighty, so I've gone ahead and put it on. 
And as you can see with how large they are, it's quite big. <laughs> um, they smack into each other easily, which probably would not be the best situation. Um, I definitely don't think I'm going to be wearing this. And um, I will probably display it on the chain, hanging it up somehow. Um, so they just hang down and are pretty. Um, I just don't see how this could really work as an actual accessory. Um, I think if you're younger or if you're going to a convention, maybe it would work out for day-to-day -day use. I just don't see it working out for me. Um, the size also, I mean, I don't really have a very small dainty wrist and these are quite large on me. I'll zoom back a bit so you can see a little bit more. Um, the chain itself was not too hard to put on and, um, I was happy, you know, having a larger Western wrist, you know, the chain is sufficient to fit around, uh, someone who doesn't have a very slender wrist. So that works out, um, pretty well. And they're, they're quite pretty. I really do enjoy these. I just don't think they're going to work out as a fashion accessory for me per se. Um, but I hope that this video has helped to show you guys what it looks like in person and how detailed they are so let me know what you guys think in the comments I will have some more videos up soon uh, we have a couple of other uh, gashapon sets that we're going to film and if there's anything you guys would like to see let me know have a great day thanks for watching